And this week, let's talk about you know, how to be a good host. What are the elements uh, we should think about before we go up there to do our thing? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, we are doing the uh, open mic workshop inside. We are pretty serious about this. No, no, very serious about this. Getting prepared for the gig on Friday. You know what I'm saying? All right, uh, a few days ago, uh, Rome, Zip and I we were talking about uh, how to be a good host of uh, an event. And this week, let's talk about you know, how to be a good host. What are the elements uh, we should think about before we go up there to do our thing. You know what I'm saying? Oh, new house, new barbecue shop across the office. Hopefully, uh, it will bring more traffic uh, to this street and uh, then everyone will be happy inside, you know what I'm saying? Okay, back to the topics, uh, being a good host. But, let me put it this way, being a good host doesn't mean only the host on stage. I mean, let's say if you uh, host a party, you are also a host, you know what I'm saying? Or if you are delivering a meeting, you are also the host who call the meeting, you know what I'm saying? But uh, let's focus a little bit more on how to be a good host on stage. Love this vibe outside, love it. All right, um, you know, before any gigs, you need to find out the sex W, right? The sex W. And uh, for example, like when is the gig, where is the gig? So make sure you get there on time. And also like, uh, what's the theme? You know, what uh, I should wear, things like this, you know. Let me tell you this, if you are late or you wear something inappropriate, I would say your confidence level drop like at least half before even the gig starts. Hey guys, I'm at Bike, the boys are at the back. All right, being a good host, you really need to know the key messages you want to deliver. For example, this is the purpose of the event. This is to help rebound. Or those are the key sponsors of the event. Or this is the call to actions we need your help, like adding the WeChat. Important! You know why you are there? Oh god, it's too dark. Can't see my face. Bring my light. <laughs> too bright. Alright, that's up alright. <laughs> that's up alright. Alright, uh, being a host on stage. Um, you know, one key thing is how to interact with other guys who will perform on stage. If you deliver a speech or sing a song, a band or whatever, how to interact with them. Because some of them, they may be very, very good, but some of them, they may be really, really bad. So for the good one, how can let them to do a bit more and for the bad one, how to politely ask them to leave. You know what I'm saying? And also the audience, how to build the interaction with the audience. I tell you tips. When you go on stage, try to find a few people they can really interact with you and those people can help you a lot. Hey guys, uh, happy 4th of July. I'm Lee Zegi Chang'an, the bar in Chang'an. Come and support guys. Alright, back to the topics. Uh, being a host at different gigs, you know, things can happen. How about the next performer? He or she is late and what should you do then? So always equip with something. Maybe you can sing a song, do a dance, tell a joke. You know what I'm saying? So always have the plan B if something happens on stage. Then you can still entertain the audience. Hey guys, being a host, remember we are not the center of attention. Our job is to make others shine. And main role is to make sure the flow of the whole event from the beginning to the end is smooth. Alright, until next time, uh, I see you next week. Peace!